Easy and yummy Cajun shrimp, fish, and rice skillet dinner. If you take a look around, you probably have all the ingredients. Trust me, you're going to like this one. Stay tuned. In my skillet on medium heat, I'm adding in three tablespoons of butter, one small diced onion, two diced stalks of celery, and a good pinch of salt and black pepper. Cooking and stirring for three to four minutes or until the onions soften. This is one diced red bell pepper. You can use any color of pepper, but I think the red gives it a nice sweet note. And of course, we gotta have lots of garlic. And this is five large minced cloves. Don't forget we have a lot to flavor here. Cooking and stirring for one minute. This is one and a half cups of rinsed and drained long grain rice. Giving that a good mix with the vegetables and butter for a couple minutes. This is going to help keep the rice fluffy and not clump together later in the cooking process. Adding in one 14 and a half ounce can of diced tomatoes with the juices and stirring to mix. This is one cup of clam juice and this will help add some nice seafood flavor to this entire dish. And I'm following up with one and a half cups of chicken broth. Turning my heat up to bring this up to a simmer. Now we're going to add some more flavor. I have one tablespoon of Cajun seasoning and mine has a little heat. Two teaspoons of Old Bay seasoning and one teaspoon each of parsley and oregano. And a sprinkle more of black pepper. Stirring to incorporate. The inspiration for this skillet meal was finding a bag of frozen steelhead trout pieces left over from another recipe video and some cooked shrimp in the freezer. You can use any fish like cod, haddock, catfish, or tilapia. And if you wanted, you could use raw shrimp and cook down the shells for a seafood stock to make it even richer. And who is looking? You can also toss in some canned clams, shrimp or oysters, imitation crab, or even some sardines. Stirring in the fish and placing the shrimp on top. Or you could also stir in the shrimp. Make it your own. Bringing this up to a simmer, covering tightly, turning my heat down to the low setting, and cooking for 20 minutes. Remember to set your timer. After 20 minutes, remove from the heat and don't touch for another 10 to 15 minutes. Don't be tempted to peek or lift that lid. After it's done resting, Remove the lid and breathe in that wonderful smell. Garnishing with some chopped green onions and lemon slices. This is a beautiful skillet meal that can be taken right to the table and let everyone dig in. There's lots of shrimp and fish in this easy skillet meal to go around. The rice is nice and fluffy and filled with lots of seafood flavors. Take a peek in your freezer. I'm sure you can find some seafood to make your version of this easy and delicious shrimp and fish and rice skillet meal. Enjoy! If you like this video recipe, please remember to hit the like and subscribe button to receive my future recipes. Please feel free to share my channel with your friends and family. It really helps my channel grow and it is greatly appreciated. And until next time, much love!